I've got some random Twitter questions from our random Twitter following. I hope that's oh, okay. Of course. All right. Number one. Uh, the first question was from at Helen Holmes, who wants you to spell Searsha. Oh, it's really difficult, this. That's not fair. <laughs> I'm going to spell it wrong, but I think it's S A O S A O I R S A. Yeah, S A O I. It's so hard. I'm going to cheat. <laughs> R-S-A-O-I-R-S-E. Yeah, I wasn't fired. That's pretty sure you were actually most of the way there. Usually you, you have it. to go sour, sir. And then that's the way it's spelled, but obviously it's Saoirse. It's a noble stab until you started cheating. Second question. Um, <laughs> at DJ Skinny Latte wants to know what the first thing you do is if you had eternal life. Um, I don't know if you'd be under a lot of time pressure. Wouldn't you just do something like jump off a building? Like, wouldn't you just do something really risque and know you weren't going to die from it? Or does that mean you're in, in does it mean that you, you can't hurt yourself? I mean, it needs to be more specific. All right. We need to, we need to go back. <laughs> I would do some crazy stuff, I think, you know, like thrill seeker stuff. At Scene Sum wants to know would you consider playing Lara Croft if they were to make this suggested Tomb Raider re reboot? Oh, yeah. Would that appeal to you? <laughs> well, as long as the script was good, <laughs> that's what everyone says, isn't it? As long as the script was good. Um, do you know what, though? I've always loved Tomb, Tomb Raider. When I was a kid, when Tomb Raider first came out, I was like 12 or 13. And me and my sister, she would play the game and I would tell her what to do. I'd say, OK, we need to go over there and find the medical pack. And now Lara's <laughs> going to do this. And, and it was I was the brains behind it, the operation. And she was the active, the activator. And so and when I was playing Clara, my sister, I'd send her pictures going, oh, I just jumped through a roof or oh, I just did this. And she'd go, oh, it's so exciting. It's like Lara, but cool. <laughs> <laughs> so, Lara, but real. That's it. Lara, but real. She could. So you're a backseat gamer, effectively. Well, yeah, but I'm not very good with the operation bit. I'm, I'm more the, the brains. The brains behind the operation, <laughs> as we said. At Legless Fair wants to know, because I know you're a dad pan in the kitchen, profiteroles or apple crumble? Apple crumble. Come on. Really? Come on. Okay. Yeah. At Enjoy Jessica would like to know what you like most about vampires. Oh, uh, um, mm, oh, that's quite hard. Um, well, it's complex. They're complex characters, and that's always interesting to, to look at complex characters. Tell me about the um, extended finger. Thing. Did you get to keep one of those? Because I know you have your prosthetic nose from... No, I, I didn't, and I should have. It would have looked a bit weird, though, just a fingernail. Because yeah. uh, I, I, usually I put them in little box frames, and that would have been a bit creepy. But no, Neil decided that he didn't want them to... Ori originally, we were going to have, like, implements that we used, like a, a blade that we just, you know. Yeah. And and then Neil thought it would be cooler if, if, if we had these talons that, that grow, grew. I didn't want us to have fangs because, um, you know, we wanted to do something different. So, and um, we have these these kind of freaky ghetto style um, nails. <laughs> <laughs> ghetto style. Yeah, we just need a little diamante on there, and then <laughs> we'd be set. And you're in the bling ring. Yeah. <laughs> At M B Reborn, would like to know which actor or actress you've worked with that you've enjoyed working with the most, or would like to work with again. Oh, there's lots actually. Um, uh, which actor or act actor or actor? Um, I just worked with Ryan Reynolds, and I have to tell you, he's a brilliant guy to work with. A great actor, and who knows, we might work together again. He's not the only one. Um, I'd Saoirse actually it was a joy to work with. I'd love to work with her again in some way. I usually feel like that with everyone I just finished <laughs> working with. At Lucy99, she loved Persepolis and wants to know what you can tell us about the voices, which is the Ryan Reynolds oh film that you God. mentioned. It sounds a little crazy on the page. It There's is. talking animals. It's extraordinary. Who do you play? I play, um, oh, it's very hard to describe it without going into detail. I play an office worker that works with Ryan's character in a toilet factory um, who he ends up. Um, accidentally murdering um, and uh, as she's called Fiona and yeah I, I mean it's I think I've never been so excited about the film that I've made and the director Marjan Stripati is a genius uh, not to be used lightly that term but she really is and um, I think it's Ryan's best performance 
And yeah, I, 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 I've got nothing but good vibes about this film. It's really going to be special, I think. Do you get to call her Margie? Or, yeah. yeah. I'm one of those. <laughs> oh, nice. Marge.